now the story of a wealthy family who lost everything and the one son who had no choice but to keep them all together. It's Arrested Development. Michael Bluth was taking his son to an interview at the prestigious Milford School, an institution once famous for its credo that children should be neither seen nor heard. Woman. They're not getting in. But, Dad, you know, I might not get in either, and that wouldn't be the end of the world. I'm not even going down that road, okay? The next four years are all about your future, and that's the most important thing to me, okay? And things have changed around here. We have talking sessions throughout the day. We even have a talking room where students are encouraged to go in and talk to their heart's content. Sounds like fun. First thing he said all day. The point is, I am not my father. I do think it's best for the Milford School to distance itself from the Bluth name. It's, it's nothing personal. Are you talking about the fact that my father is in jail? Because uh, I don't like to be compared to my father either. I don't mind being compared to my father. Save it for the talk room, son. I'm sorry. I can assure you that my family is back on track and no longer in any trouble. Not according to today's paper. God, what have we done this time? Don't ever mention Klimpies to me again. What did you do? If I still had money, I'd buy you Klimpies just to burn it to the ground. I know, Mom, you hate Klimpies. Tell me what happened. Well, your sister and I tried to get into that new restaurant, Wood, and they wouldn't let us in. Mrs. Bluth, there's absolutely no room. Come on, I've suddenly lost my appetite. Oh, who's gonna believe that? With her blood sugar at a perilous low, Lucille made Lindsay pull into the nearest restaurant. Welcome to Klimpies, anywhere you like. This does not bode well. I'll have the Ike and Tina tuna. Plate or platter? I don't understand the question, and I won't respond to it. Then what would you like? I'd like my old life back. So there really was no fight? Well, one tiny thing at the end. How could you treat me this way? Oh, please! <laughs> Everything I've said about you can be covered with makeup and a lie about a thyroid problem. Good grief <laughs> almighty. You think I'm enjoying my slide into comedy? <laughs> Sorry, Lindsay. There goes your dessert. Why don't you eat it, Mother? 